If you've seen Samsung Cloud in your phone settings or wondered what it really does, you might be curious if it's still useful. In this quick video, I'll break it all down. What Samsung Cloud is, what it does, and whether you should still use it. What is Samsung Cloud? Samsung Cloud is Samsung's built-in backup and sync service for Galaxy devices. It was designed to backup important phone data like contacts, call logs, messages, and settings. Sync things like calendars and notes across multiple Samsung devices. Help restore your data when you switch phones or reset your device. Basically, it's your safety net for keeping your personal data secure and easy to restore. How to use Samsung Cloud Getting started is simple. Go to Settings, Accounts, and Backup. Choose what you want to backup, like contacts, messages, or app data. Hit Backup to store it securely in the cloud. Later, you can restore that backup on the same device or a new Galaxy phone. You can also access Samsung Cloud through a web browser, though you can't directly download files. Restores only happen through a phone. What changed with Samsung Cloud? Here's the big update. Gallery Sync and Drive Storage were discontinued in 2021. Photos and videos no longer back up here. Instead, Samsung partnered with Microsoft OneDrive for photo and video storage. Today, Samsung Cloud mainly focuses on device data backup, things like contacts, settings, notes, and messages. So if you're looking to backup your photos, you'll need OneDrive, Google Photos, or another cloud service. Is Samsung Cloud safe? Yes, Samsung Cloud is secure, and with recent updates, it's even safer. Encryption protects your backed up data. Newer devices, like the Galaxy S24, even support end-to-end -end encryption with recovery codes. Only your Samsung account and verified devices can restore your data. So while it's not as feature-rich as before, what's left of Samsung Cloud is reliable for core backups. To check more details, check out our full post, link in the description. So Samsung Cloud today is mainly about protecting your core phone data, while OneDrive and other apps handle photos and files. Do you still use Samsung Cloud? Or did you fully switch to Google or OneDrive? Drop your thoughts in the comments. And if this breakdown helped you, Give it a like and subscribe for more simple, no fluff tech explainers that actually make your life easier. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.